Ever wondered how the items you use daily come into existence? Well, it's a question that opens up a fascinating world. A world that thrives on the intricate dance of production processes. This world is not as simple as it may seem. It's a complex ballet of machines and human labor, each playing their parts to perfection, creating the everyday items we often take for granted. Picture an assembly line, a symphony of moving parts, machines whirring, conveyors humming, and amidst all this, the human element. Workers with skilled hands and sharp minds guiding the process, ensuring everything runs smoothly. It's a perfect blend of human ingenuity and mechanical precision, a testament to our ability to create and innovate, but this is just the surface. Dive deeper and you'll uncover the true heart of these processes, modern technology and automation. Like an invisible conductor, they orchestrate this intricate symphony, increasing its tempo, enhancing its harmony, and refining its melody. The result? Greater efficiency, improved quality, and a production process that's truly mesmerizing to behold. Automation, in particular, has revolutionized the way we produce. From robotics and car manufacturing to AI-driven quality control, it's a game-changer, pushing the boundaries of what's possible. It's not just about doing things faster or more accurately, it's about doing things we could never do before. And then, there's technology. It's the catalyst that sparks innovation in production. Advanced software systems streamline operations, complex machinery refines processes, and cutting-edge innovations like 3D printing redefine the very concept of creation. It's a world where the impossible becomes possible, where the unimaginable becomes reality. But don't just take my word for it, join me as we embark on a journey. A journey that takes us behind the scenes of some of the most astonishing production processes on the planet. From the birth of the automobile to the creation of your favorite chocolate bar, from sand to glass, we'll explore it all. So buckle up and hold on tight. Get ready to journey through the most astonishing production processes that are sure to make your hair stand on end. Imagine a world without cars. Seems impossible, right? Now, how do these machines come to life? The birth of an automobile is a captivating process that begins with a simple concept, the design. In the heart of every automotive company, there are teams of creative minds who sketch, model, and refine the look of a future automobile. They contemplate every curve, every line, every detail, down to the smallest screw. It's a marriage of art and engineering where the aesthetic appeal must meet functionality and safety regulations. Once the design is finalized, it's time for a little magic called prototyping. This is where the two-dimensional sketch transforms into a three-dimensional model. Engineers and designers work hand-in-hand, -hand, using advanced software and technology to bring the design to life. They scrutinize every element, ensuring the model is not only beautiful but also aerodynamically efficient, safe, and feasible for mass production. Following the prototyping phase, the approved design moves on to the production line. Here, precision and coordination are vital. Picture a symphony where each instrument plays its part at exactly the right time. In the automotive world, this symphony is an assembly line of robots and workers, each performing specific tasks with meticulous precision. They weld, they bolt, they install, and they inspect, all in a synchronized dance that results in a fully assembled vehicle. But the birth of an automobile doesn't end there. Each vehicle must undergo rigorous testing for safety, performance, and durability. It's pushed to its limits, tested under extreme conditions, all to ensure that it's ready to hit the road and deliver a smooth, safe ride. The birth of an automobile is a journey of thousands of miles, starting from a single sketch and ending in a machine that's ready to conquer the roads. It's a testament to human ingenuity and the power of technology. The next time you sit in a car, remember the intricate process that brought it to life. Ever enjoyed a chocolate bar and wondered how it came to be? It all begins in the tropics where cacao trees flourish. These trees produce large pods which hold the precious cacao beans, the heart and soul of every chocolate bar. Once the pods are harvested, they are cracked open to reveal around 40 beans each. The beans are then fermented for up to a week. This fermentation process is crucial as it develops the beans' distinct chocolate flavor. After fermentation, the beans are dried under the sun for about a week, turning them into the raw cacao we know. Next, these beans embark on a journey to the chocolate factories. Here, they undergo a roasting process, which further brings out the rich, chocolatey aroma we all adore. The temperature and duration of roasting are carefully controlled to ensure the beans don't burn, 
but instead develop a deep, intense flavor. Following roasting, the beans are cracked and winnowed, a process that separates the outer shells from the inner cacao nibs. These nibs are the essence of chocolate, and they're about to undergo a transformation that will turn them into the chocolate bars we love. The nibs are then ground into a paste known as chocolate liquor. Despite its name, there's no alcohol here. It's purely cacao, and it's the base for all chocolate products. The chocolate liquor can be further processed into cocoa solids and cocoa butter, the two main ingredients in a chocolate bar. The final stage in the creation of a chocolate bar is tempering. The chocolate is carefully heated, then cooled, and then gently rewarmed. This process gives the chocolate its glossy finish and that satisfying snap when you break a piece off. So, the journey from cacao bean to chocolate bar is a complex one. It involves careful cultivation, precise roasting, meticulous grinding, and delicate tempering. Each step is vital and contributes to the final product's taste, texture, and appearance. The next time you savor a chocolate bar, consider the complex process that makes it so delicious. What if we told you that the glass in your window started as simple sand? Yes, the journey from a grainy substance to a transparent marvel is as intriguing as it sounds. It all begins with sand, specifically silica sand, a high-quality sand due to its high content of silicon dioxide. This sand is mixed with soda ash and limestone, the former lowers the melting point of the sand and the latter stabilizes the mixture. The concoction is then heated to a scorching temperature of around 2700 degrees Fahrenheit, a heat so intense that it could melt a car. This process, known as melting, transforms the mixture into a molten state, creating what we call molten glass. But the magic doesn't stop there. The molten glass is then poured onto a bath of molten tin, where it floats and spreads out forming a perfectly flat surface. This process, known as floating, gives us the flat glass used in windows and mirrors. However, creating glass isn't just about science, there's a touch of artistry involved as well. The glass must be rapidly cooled, or annealed, to relieve internal stresses and prevent it from cracking. This requires careful control and precision. Too fast and the glass may shatter, too slow and it may become too brittle. Finally, the glass is inspected for any imperfections. Any piece that doesn't meet the high standards of clarity and smoothness is recycled back into the process, ensuring no material goes to waste. So you see, the transformation of sand into glass is a mesmerizing dance of science and art, a testament to human ingenuity. It's a process that's been refined over thousands of years, a process that combines the raw power of intense heat with the delicate touch of precision. The next time you look through a glass window, remember the fiery process that created it. The humble pane of glass is a testament to our ability to harness and shape the world around us, turning simple sand into something truly extraordinary. From the car you drive to the chocolate you eat and the glass you look through, production processes are a marvel of human ingenuity. Let's take a moment to marvel at the intricacies we've unveiled today. The automobile, an emblem of modernity and freedom, begins as a mere sheet of metal. It's transformed through a symphony of mechanical ballet, involving pressing, welding, painting and assembly, until it finally emerges as a sleek, shiny testament to human innovation. Then there's the chocolate bar, a simple treat that hides a complex process within its velvety folds. From the harvesting of cocoa beans in tropical climates to the careful fermentation, drying and roasting. Then, the meticulous grinding, conching, tempering and molding that result in the smooth melt-in-your-mouth delicacy we all love. And who could forget the transformation of sand into glass? This everyday material, so common yet so intricate, begins its journey in the fiery heart of a furnace. Heated to over a thousand degrees, it's then molded, blown, or drawn into the transparent, versatile substance that fills our windows, graces our tables, and even forms the screens of our devices. Each of these processes embodies a testament to human creativity and endeavor. They are a remarkable blend of science, art, and technology working together to transform raw materials into the items we use and appreciate every day. And yet these are just a few examples of the countless production processes that shape our world. So the next time you hop into your car, savor a piece of chocolate, or peer through a glass window, take a moment to appreciate the journey these items have taken. Consider the intricate dance of machinery and human labor, the triumph of technology and automation, and the sheer marvel of human ingenuity that brought them into being. Remember, the world is full of amazing processes waiting to be discovered.